We have seen this module, we are going to discuss about what are the solutions for exponents in first exercise. So, our first question is write base and exponent. So, in alphabet, one logic I will tell you how to remember. In alphabet, B will come first and exponent E or power will come next. So, based on that B, first number which will be there, that one will be base or which one will be there down that is always base which one will be there up that is power or exponent so here so base is 3 our first question base is 3 and exponent is 4 so what is the meaning of uh, exponent there so here that number will be there 4 times in multiplication 3 into 3 into 3 into 3 so here 3 will be there in multiplication 4 times. Next. So, 7x is base. 7x is base. Exponent is 2. Then 5ab is base. 5ab is base. Exponent is 3. 4y is base. Exponent is 5. Next. So, they ask us to, in second question, they ask us to write given equation in exponential form. How to write? So, you know, whatever it is, we have to take the same number into one time and that may, how many times it is there in multiplication, that many times will be there, will take in, in the exponent's place. So, here 7 into 7 into 7 into 7, 7 into 7. How many times? Exponential form for this. First time, base one time, that is 7. How many times it is present in multiplication? That many times you have to write in exponential place. So, 5 times. 7 power 5. Then, 3 into 3 into 3. So, write. If it is a different numbers, we have to write differently. If it is the same number, we will write only one time. So, here 3 and 5 both are uh, different one. So, for 3, how many times it is there? We will write exponential form separately for 3 and exponential form separately for 5 and we will going to group that 2 exponential forms with that multiplication. So, here 3 is 3 times into 5 base. How many times? 4 times. Then, for this exponential form, 2 into 2 into 2, 2 is 3 times, 3 is 4 times, 5 is 3 times. So, here here we are finished exponential forms and go to the third question. We have to divide this into exponential form by using prime factorization. What is meant by prime factorization? In prime factorization, we have to take only prime numbers only. First, we have to start with the 2. If that number is not divisible by 2, then we have to go for the 3. If it is a divisible, divisible by 2, uh, then again it is also divisible by some other things uh, 5. Let's take uh, if it's a unit space is 0 then both will be divisible by 2 and 5. We should not go for a 5. It is better to start with all base 2 and 3 and like that only. If it's not divisible by 2 then we have to go for 3. If it is not divisible by 3 then we have to go for 5. Like that only you have to proceed. Don't go directly 5, 7, 11 like that. So here 2, 2, 88. This one will be divisible by this one will be divisible by 2. Why? Because in unit space it is an even number. So 2 ones are 2 fours are 2 fours are. Then again it is also divisible by 2 2 sevens are 2 twos are. Again it is also divisible by 2 threes are 2 six are. So 2 threes are 6 and 2 six are. This is also divisible by 2 ones are 2 eights are 2 9 the 3 3 the. so 9 is uh, not divisible by 9 is not divisible by 2 for that we are taking again proceed with the 3 so here 3 that's it so we are ended with one prime number so finally we should get prime numbers only or uh, not divisible as yes, prime numbers we should get so 288 will be 3 into 3 into how many twos 5 twos into 2 into 2 into 2 into 2. So, here 3 is there in 2 times 3 square 3 power 2 square 2 power 5. So, this is the prime uh, exponential form by using prime factorization. 
then 1 to 5 0 then 1 to 5 0 is divisible by 2 and 5 but we have to go with 2 only so 1 2 5 0 2 6 12 2 2 4 2 5 10 2 5 10 there so then it's not divisible by 2 5 why because in its place 5 it's odd number it's not divisible by 2 then we have to check with the 3 so 3 to the 3 again it's not divisible by 3 then finally we have to go for the 5 only so here 5 5 1 the 5 12 5 2 the 5 to the 10 and 5 5 the 25 then again we have to check whether it's a divisible by 2 or not so it is not divisible by 2 it is not also divisible by it's not also divisible by 3 then we have to go for 5 only 5 to the 5 5 the. so 5 to the 10 and 5 5 the 25 then it is also 5 5 then how to write 1 to 5 0 5 into 5 into 5 into 5 into 5 into 2 so 5 power 4 into 2 power 1 so like this we have to complete so our third one is it is also it is divisible by 2 and it is also divisible by 5 but we have to go with 5 only sorry 2 only 2 to 5 0 2 ones are 2 ones are 2 to the 4 2 5 the 10 and we have to check with is that divisible by 3 or not it's not divisible by 3 by because if you 1 plus 1 2 2 plus 2 1 plus 1 2 maybe it is divisible by uh, 3 we'll check so how it is is maybe it will be divisible by 1 plus 1 2 2 plus 2 4 or 9 it will be maybe divisible so 3 3 3 is a 9 3 4 is a 12 3 3 is a 9 3 3 is a 9, 9 uh, 11 minus 9 will be 22, uh, then 3 7 is a 3 5 is a, so 3 7 is a 3 5 is a, okay, again it is divisible by, is that divisible by 3 or not, we have 3 1 is a, 3 2 is a 6, again it will go with 3, so 3 1, 3 1 is a, sorry sorry, 3 1 is a, 3, 3 2 is a 6, 3, 2, 6, 3, 3, 3, 5, are. again, then it is not divisible by 2, it is not also divisible by 3, then go for 5, so 5, 2, 5, 5, are. then 5, 5, are. now 2, 2, 5, 0, you can write it in the form at all, 5 into 5 into 5, into 3 into 3 into 2, so 5 cube, 3 square 2 power 1 so like this we have to solve so is there any doubts please comment below and please subscribe thanks for watching hello in here we are going to explain how to prime factorize in the 3600 and 2400 here 3600 it is divisible by 5 and it is also divisible by 2 but we have to go with 2 so 2 ones are 2 remaining 1 2 8 is a double zero 2 2 9 is a double zero. 2 4 is a 8. Again. Again 2. 2 2 is a 2 2 is a 2 5 is a. Again it is not divisible by 2. But it, is, it will be divisible by 3. 3 7 is a 3 5 is a. Again it is also divisible by 3. So 3 2 is a 3 5 is a. 5 5. So here we will write this one as 2 into 2 into 2 into 2 how many twos 4 twos into 3 into 3 into 5 so 2 power 5 into 3 square into 5 so like that it is there in prime factorization then 2 for 2 4 double 0 then go with 2 2 ones are 2 2 the 2 double zeros then again 2 2 6 are Again 2, 2 3 is a 2, 2 1 is a 2 5 is a 2 1 is a 2, 2 5 is a 10, again 0, again 2, 2 7 is a 2 5 is a, so 2 7 is a 14, remaining 1 will be there 2 5 is a, then again it is not divisible by 2, then we have to check with 
3. So 3 2 is a 2 3 5 is a 15. So it is not divisible by 2, it is also not divisible by 3. Then we have to go for 5. Next prime number 5. 5 5 is a. So how we'll write is 2 into 2 into 2. 5 2s are there into 3 into 5 into 5. So 2 power 5 into 3 into 5 square. So like this we have to solve the through prime factorization method. So please subscribe. Thanks for watching.